On and on. We will try and get AJ's response later in the week, but you know, just know this one sustained winning streak and poof, the bandwagon starts filling up again. Meanwhile, Rick Willis goes from thoroughbred horse racing to thoroughbred kickers. Rick taking in John Carney's NFL launching pad program. It happens every year, just like the Swallows returning to Capistrano. During the summer, NFL kickers return to San Diego to work with John Carney in his NFL launching pad. Well, I mean, he's more than a swing coach. You know, right now we're working on our swing. And, you know, more important than having a good swing, you got to be able to have that swing for 17 weeks and then the playoffs and then possibly the Super Bowl. So what I've learned from John is how to be able to do that over a five-month period. 23 years in an NFL uniform and the fifth leading scorer in NFL history. You can say John Carney has kicking down to a science. <laughs> I probably have a doctorate maybe. Uh, <laughs> I enjoy it, and now that I'm I'm focusing more on uh, analyzing kickers and punters, I'm, I'm even learning more now and uh, talking about angles and steps and punt uh, drops and the height and and then picking their brains. Uh, that's one of the reasons why I came today because I was having some problems with my field goals, and he helped me out, and we got some film. And we're gonna break that down later. And hanging out here with John Carney and the rest of these NFL kickers, you learn a lot of fun facts. One of the most interesting is, did you know that they stuff their feet? into their cleats. And I'm wearing a size eight cleat and I usually wear about a 10 in men's shoes. So. Normally I wear a nine, and then and my kicking shoe, yeah. uh, usually a seven. Uh, I went down to a six and a half one season with the Giants. I wear a 10 and a half normally, sometimes an 11. Uh, kicking shoe, I wear a nine and a half. So, I mean, I've done uh, some crazy stuff to breaking cleats. I've gone in steam rooms and dumped water on them to, to make them mold to my foot a little more. So. Uh, we're already dubbed as a weird brand being a kicker, and that makes us a little bit more weird. You only got three hours to deal with it, and then you can go home with a victory, knowing that you did your job well, and you can put your foot in a bucket of ice and uh, watch PPR. From North County, Rick Willis, KUSI Sports. JC, thanks for the plug. Good news for 